And since it's time for paint talk, I know I'm a little bit late tonight, but I just did an interview um, on the Creative Connection with Miss Denise O'Hare of Upsheet Glitz and Glam. So I am going to start a new abstract with you guys tonight, and I wanted to start with Water Lily. It's one of my very favorite favorite colors from DIY. How are you guys? I know I'm a little bit late, but I had a wonderful interview just a minute ago with Denise O'Hare. She actually joined us a couple weeks ago on here. So hello, everybody. I'm starting with Water Lily, and I'm going to get started on this huge canvas. I believe it's 30 by 40, I think. Uh, and Matt's here, so if you have any questions or comments, ask him. And I believe here over here on Instagram, you guys, I am actually going live for the first time on Instagram on the Turquoise Cyrus Journal. So welcome. I like to pop on here and I'm going to be popping on here a lot more often um, on the journal page and doing a weekly live on there as well. So if you guys are not already following it, I would love it if you would. I'm going to start with the VIP. It's a six inch brush from Paint Pixie. I'm going to jump on in there right now. Okay, so... Matthew, what do we think we should start with on this abstract? Color. Color. We got that down, but I'm going to lightly mist. This is a clay-based paint uh, that I use on my furniture and often on my artwork as well. So I'm going to lightly mist the canvas, and then Matt, I'm going to ask you if you don't mind to go fill this back up. Oh, man, I got to cross the I'm sorry. It's almost, it's almost gone. Okay. So I am basically just trying to get some color on here. And this is a gorgeous periwinkle color. I'm not even going to brush all of that out. I'm going to leave some of that swooped across there in the thick chunks. But because it's such a thick paint, Okay, I'm going to leave that, and I'm going to leave that, and a little bit of that little swoop there. Thank you, darling. So if you're new here, thanks for hanging out. If you have any questions, I like to pop on here every single day and paint. Um, sometimes it's on canvas. Sometimes it's not. So, <sighs> well, I can do that. Now, the next color, I don't want to make it look muddy. And I feel like I would, so I got to be really careful about what color I choose next. Um, I think I'm going to actually get an acrylic in a magenta color. Nope, I'm lying. Baked you out. I'm actually going to get this cobalt blue. Okay, this is a cobalt. And I'm going to kind of dwindle or weave in some of that color into this periwinkle. Matthew, is anybody on here with us? We've got two people on here and we've got three people on YouTube. Sweet. So just get after it, do what you want to do. Sweet. They will slowly come on here, I bet. Okay. All right, so I want to make sure those colors don't get perfectly blended. But I'm going to hold my brush like this and just get some of that cobalt going in here. It was really fun working on this big one the other day that we nicknamed Spirit Animals. The turquoise iris would like to know, hey, Dion, I have a message from Mitch. Okay, what's up? What's up, Mr. Mitch? I don't know. She has She's going to tell us. Okay. I want this to have a lot. What I, what I love about most of my abstracts, what I, I have to have lots of flow and lots of rhythm, lots of, they're, they're really high energy. Energy? Energy. Honey, I like my paintings to have energy. Does that mean like, it make, it like gives you energy? Is that what you're talking about? Like, well, for one, I do. It, it lifts me up and makes me feel, yes, very energized. But normally when I'm painting like this, I have a lot of energy and I, feel like that I need that to come across in my artwork, honey. You paint your feelings. So and I always have a lot to say. You are an emotional cat. I always have a lot to say. And so I am using the VIP, which if you haven't 
used a large brush like this, it comes in very handy also to base coat my furniture as well. Okay, the turquoise iris says, Mitch watched another live this evening. This person did not have a mat to read for them and do all the things. Yep. Mitch said, you are not paying Matt enough and he needs a raise. Rich, Mitch, I say Rich, it's Mitch. You, you said I'm not, Mitch said I'm not paying Matt enough? Yes, yes, because um, I bring a ton of value to the program. Okay, well, I know that. And right. he says I need a significant raise. Wow, Mitch, that's pretty, uh, that's pretty heavy there. It's and he said this on where? Where did Michelle write that? Um, that was on the books, on the Facebooks. Hmm. Well, so what should we do about that, I, Mitch? No, ask Mitch what we should Mitch, do about that. Mitch, I think you need to throw a number out there, and um, she'll probably listen to you before she listens to me. All right, I'm, this was Old 57. This was another DIY color. It's a really great turquoise. And the reason I'm working on the floor tonight, guys, um, I just sometimes I like to start my canvases that way so I can walk, walk all the way around it. I don't want it to look as if it's obvious it's upright or sideways. I just I want to be able to walk all the way around it and look from different angles without having to flip it. Lolly Lolly says, Nick is probably a paid friend of Matt's. Lisa Dixon says, beyond double Matt's salary, that if she doubles it, that will give me $4. Ooh, look at this, baby. I like it. Ooh, it looks like waves crashing. Love it. Uh, Susan, uh, it was storming here. It was pretty bad. Um, it has moved out since then, but uh, yes, it was stormy for you. Which we needed some rain. I'll tell you, we needed some rain. Okay, I'm going to leave this really thick and chunky, but I'm going to get that turquoise overlap with the periwinkle is gorgeous. I'm not going to wash all of those lines out, though, I don't think. I'm going to put some gold in here in a sec. Y'all ready for some gold? Uh, Tasha Watkins said, okay, let's give him a 50 cent increase. All right, you're up to 450 then, babe. I'm doing pretty good. I might be able to uh, pay for uh, dinner for too long. 450? You got a long ways to go. I'm just talking about like McDonald's dollar value. Oh, well. All right, let's get some gold in here, guys. Who's having fun? I am. I am. You guys, if you are not subscribed to the Turquoise Cyrus Journal, I want you to know um, that the cover reveal will be the first week of January and Miss Quita Allen will be our featured artist. And Matthew, I cannot open this. <gasps> Get your tool. Okay. Um, but I am going to start a weekly show over on the journal Facebook page. I do not have a journal YouTube. Um, but it will be on the Facebook page and Instagram. What would you like to see me do more of, or would you rather me have guests on? Okay, so this little dilly whopper. Turns the, dilly, the doohickey. It turns the doohickey. Wait, oh honey, I don't. You gotta hold, you gotta kinda hold that in your hand when you tighten it. Hold it down, hold it back in your hand. Huh? Hold it in your hand. Your other hand, where the handle is. Oh, put it on the handle. What? Just listen to my words. I am. Put the strap on the handle. Grab the handle and the strap at the same time. This? Mm, there you go. Pull tight. Pull it back. Turn on the handle. And turn. What's this doesn't do me any good if I can't figure out how to work it. I just told you three times how to work it. You're still not listening. Almost got it. It's worked before. I think I almost got it. Sorry guys, this is so uneventful. Did you get it? I don't think so. I 
think I just turned the Righty tight. Are you turning it the right way? There you go. I don't know if I got it or not, but it's open. Okay, so this is Golden Ticket. This is a liquid patina, and I kind of just want like a big splash of gold in one place. And so, yes, I'm going to, I kind of want it like sprayed. Um, let me think about this, guys. I got an idea. Okay, so when I was in McKinney, Donna at Doozy's Corner gave me these right here for paint. And I think if I put this down in the golden ticket, I should be able to pull some of that up in there. And then I should be able to go and squirt it onto the canvas. We'll try. Never done it. Okay, this is the first. This is the first. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? Okay, so I'm going to pull it. It's mind. working. Of course it's working. Oh my, well, I just, I didn't understand how to do it. Now I get it. Oh, I don't think I needed that much. Squirt a little out. Okay. Don't get it on your pan. You see this? Oh my goodness. How fun is this? Okay. So I just want it on one edge. Hold tight. Ladies and gents, hold tight. I don't know what that means. Are you, are you excited right now? Uh-huh. Are you all ready? Okay. We're going to go down this way. Ready? On your mark. Go. Oh no. Yes. That. Abby, you can go lay back down, sissy. She got up when Matt sucked in all the air out of the room. Okay. Lava I should have watered it down first. That's what I should have done. Lolly says it's a mountain goat. A what? A mountain goat. Oh, what? I see it. Here we go with the animals. Ah. So what I should have done is put water in here and mixed it so it was really much more thin than this. I wanted it to look like it was splattered, failed. Boom. Kind of looks like a horse and an elephant had a baby. I'm, I'm just it's saying. It's just a backdrop. I'm just saying. Yeah, I hear you just saying. I'd be going down. Betty says a bison. Bison, well bison's gone. Also known as Tatanka. Cheyenne says, OMG, the animals are haunting us now. Right, Cheyenne? All right. Do you have a Quita Allen spray bottle, AKA power washer? Oh, no. I just have my water girls. Nope. But it's too thick. Not what I was wanting it to look like. Betty said it looked like a mastodon. Is that a real thing? Yes, it is. Uh, mastodon was back in the uh, the dinosaur ages. Really? Uh-huh. Huh. All right. So we're getting the backdrop going on here. Having a good time with color. I used too much gold and then didn't water it down. And I don't like the thick blob of it. So we are working it down. And I'm going to grab the catalyst wedge. All right. Thank you for the hearts. Whoever's blowing me up on Instagram on the Turquoise Irish Journal page, I'm loving you so much right now. This is my first time to go live on there. So thank you. And Lolly says it's a cave painting that was caught in the rain. <laughs> Did you say what again? Very clever, Lolly. It was a cave painting that was caught in the rain. They used to uh, paint animals, you know, in cave on cave walls, right? Yeah. And she says it was a cave painting that was in the rain. Okay. <laughs> I get you, girl.
I'm going to use my catalyst. So how was your day today? Oh, great. I had, uh, had a coaching call with Beth. And we went to the grocery store this afternoon and bought Thanksgiving food. And got some, got some, I got a bunch of stuff done today, you guys. I, our journal that, or not, excuse me, our gift guide, our holiday gift guide, Michelle and Cammie and myself have been putting together. That is coming out on Sunday, you guys. And if you're not signed up on the mailing list, please get there because that's the only way you're going to see the guide. Um, several of you have um, featured your work and, and uh, wanted to put your work in there with us. And a bunch of my favorite things are coming out on Sunday for the gift guide. Lots and lots of handmade items. Okay, now we need pink or yellow. Which one? Pink or yellow, guys? Uh, what What is the darker blue again? The darker blue is the cobalt. It's an acrylic. The turquoise and the periwinkle are DIYs, Water Lily and Old 57. Got it. Okay. Perfect. Um, getting a lot of pinks coming out here right now. A lot uh, of a pinks. Bit of, uh, Janae says blue iris. Uh, pink, 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 yellow, pink, pink, pink. Okay. Uh, Amanda, uh, just join. What tool were you using? It's a catalyst wedge. Um, yellow, yellow. It's a catalyst wedge. Thank you for the hearts on Instagram journal. It's just tap, tap, and just keep tapping it, Matt. I'm so grateful for you guys. Thank you. I, like I said, I'm going to start doing a weekly show on the journal Facebook page. So if you guys are not over there, if you uh, would sign up, you like click and like, uh, you can get turn on your notifications because I'm going to start a show on that page as well. Um, a lot of pinks and yellows. And well, we, I know. I said pink or yellow. Yeah, I know. A lot of pinks and yellows. And then we had... Uh, one orange. Okay. I thought I got orange also. Let me set it down for a sec, guys. I'm thinking black. Okay, let me get my... No, I, I'm not ready for black. Black is more later. Okay. I, I think it's probably tilting a little bit more towards pink than it is yellow, but it's a pretty good mix. Okay. Well, let's do some pink. I am actually going to get my favorite. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Let, before you do that. What? Cheyenne said orange. So you're probably going to have to do the orange. I'm going to have to go with what the boss says. The boss. The boss has the spoken. Up, the upstairs corner office said orange. <laughs> okay, we'll do orange in a minute. Betty says purple. Nope, no purple. We're going to get purple here in a second because of the pink and the blue, so that will... Oh, oh, and then she backs it up by saying, but between the two is pink. No, I um, we're going to make, end up making purple here because it's going to come out that way, mixing these colors. We're going to make purple. Okay. I like making colors. I remember doing that when I was in the... I think I was in the 12th grade. We used to make colors. 12th? Was it 12th grade? Sweetheart, what are you talking about? Like, as a senior, you made No, no, it was 11th grade, but in art class. Oh. Right? I don't remember doing that. You were in that class, and I was so distracted by you. I uh, know. I could not focus. I could not think about anything but you. I know. Okay. That was a fun class. I got to do some pottery. You know, which we, most everybody has seen. That was fun. Yeah. Maybe I should take pottery back up. Maybe you should. I was what pretty is, good at it. You could have a pottery show. You could do it and then show everybody else how to do it. Maybe maybe we could do reenact that scene from Ghost. Or not. With like Patrick Swayze and Demi Moore. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. That would be kind of cool. Okay, so there's a little bit of pink. Guys, it's still we're still just working on the background. So I like the idea of actually the orange first before we do yellow, um, but it needs to be the right shade of orange. Derek Carlton says green. No, <laughs> no green. Uh, Jay Potter would like, uh, what type of pink is that? Uh, 
the fuchsia because it's all different all different kinds this is an acrylic by grumbacher the one the pink that i just put on there it's a really deep uh violet and as you can tell it's my favorite because it's gone <laughs> okay so i have a watered down fire starter you can see it's very watered down it's almost like water but since this is a clay based paint it's extremely highly pigmented so it's going to make a really big punch when we throw it on here y'all ready are y'all ready okay let's get ready i am going to go basically like this oh yep whoa my word i love it you are a brave soul and now i'm going like that Yes, girl. That is so incredible. Hey. Yes, babe. That's what I'm talking about. Look at you. You're getting so excited. I love this. Are you going to start dancing here in a minute? It's very possible. Do you have a problem with it? Oh, not at all. Okay. Hey, you dance. You go, okay. girl. Okay. All right. There's a lot of rhythm. we got to keep it going. If I were in here by myself and not on live, I'd have music on. Just loud enough to make the boys wonder what's wrong with mom. Maybe I could sing. No, I think we're okay. Seriously, I think we're okay, babe. Okay, so now... Uh, uh, you really shut that down. I, I really want this to come this way off the canvas. But if I tilt it, that's going to run, and that is perfect. So on the Turquoise Iris Journal, what would you guys like to see me do? What kind of weekly show would you really like to see? Do you like guests? Do you want me to just to paint? Um, I think I think you should just do you. Well, I know, but I do you. I do me on the Turquoise Iris. So the journal is a little bit different because it's about our community. It's a community-inspired page and a community-inspired journal. It's all about creativity. So is it, I think it's time, she, uh, Cheyenne, it's time. I am H-A-P-P-Y, I'm H-A-P-P-Y, I don't know why I'm singing this song, I'm H-A-P-P-Y. There it is. Actually, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, actually, you don't even have to pay for that kind yeah, of. Yeah, that was free. That was free. They're really happy about this orange. I am obsessed. Who said orange? You win, you win. All right, so we're gonna do one more color tonight. So white, yellow, or black. Or bubblegum pink. I'm pretty pretty much gonna go with black. Black, yellow, bubblegum pink. Or what I say? Bubblegum? Black, yellow, go, yellow, or bubblegum. What about a peach color? Would a peach color be too, not too, wouldn't work well with the We can orange? do, no, 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 we can do peach, but you have to leave that as more, um, like this is a background. So peach is gonna need to come in at a later date. Okay. Alice says, mix it up, Dion, on the journal show. It's a good idea. I like, I like Alice's, I like, I like what she said, mixing it up. Just, you know, kind of keep everybody guessing a little bit. Yeah, I am kind of a mixing it up kind of girl. What about Tasha says white? Thank you for all of that. Oh, I did say white. I, I said white. That's why. Um, but thank you on Instagram. I see all those hearts. I see. Um, I see friends on there, too. So, okay. Jazz, um, thanks. She's got a second verse to the song. Oh, I don't know why I'm so happy inside, but I'm so, but I'm so H-A-P-P-Y. I like it. I don't know why I'm so happy inside. But I'm H-A-P-P-Y. But I'm H-A-P-P-Y. Okay. Okay. So you said white? Um, they said white? We got some pinks thrown out there. Black. Janae says black. Uh, Tammy, Tammy Orr says black. Really? Crystal Core Marie Molina says I'm here. Uh, Jane Potter says bubblegum would be a blast. All right. Vivian Young says yellow. 
I think I'm going to save the bubble gum and the yellow. I think I'm going to save it. I'm going to put just a swig of black. And again, I'm using Little Black Dress from DIY. I will move the cameras here in just a moment over the top of it because now I can't move this because of the water. But I will tilt this over here in just a second. Ooh, we should do that. That's a good idea because you know what that does? What I don't understand what it you're give, saying. It gives them a different perspective. I'm throwing out big words tonight, honey. Keep uh, up. Is that what you're doing? Throwing out big words tonight. Are you? Yep. Okay. All right, we've got black on there. Let me set it aside so I don't spill it because it's a brand new jar. Okay. Ah, uh, Maria Alcock. How inspiring to wake up to all this creativity. Wishes from South Africa. Thank you. What? Thank you, thank you. I am having a ball and I hope that you are as well. So I'm gonna take my, my VIP brush again. I don't want this black to be too severe. It's, granted, this is just a background, you guys. So a lot of this is gonna get covered up but we want some of these things to be poking out underneath the next layer. I want this to actually appear like it's in the background and that the color is lying on top of it. This orange and this blue is awesome. Great job, you guys. Ooh, the black makes it, honey. Really? Yes. They love how Abby's just watching you paint. Guys, she's almost asleep. She's using my painting as her headrest. She's a bad girl. Love the black. Do you, though? I do. I love the black. All right, we're going to leave that there. I think I'm going to start seeing something in there in just a minute. Yeah, I figure we it's are. It's starting to, to take see. some shapes. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay, I got one more, I've got one more color for tonight. Where is, bada bing, bada bang. Then you said add some white. It does need white, but I'm, 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 I think what I want to do, so my white doesn't get muddled, I want all of this to be dry before I add white, because I want the white to be pretty severe. Does that make sense? Lolly says there are two fairies. Here we go. Where are the fairies, Lolly? I don't see the fairies. Uh, Janae says the orange looks like a tornado. We see a lot of those around here. Not cool. Not cool. It's pretty cool. Tornadoes are actually quite beautiful to watch, but as long as they're like out in the middle of nowhere. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. As long as they're nowhere near me. Uh, Lisa says dove on the lower left corner. Okay. Uh, Cheyenne said it looks like a black phoenix in the top right corner. Nice. Oh, you guys are so good. Alice, that is a fact. Alice says, Matt, I know why you are H-A-P-P-Y. Because he Be lives with me. She says, because you are married to a wonderfully creative and beautiful woman. And that is facts. In fact, ooh, I like that color too. Thank you so much, you guys. Now, now we got a lightning bolt coming down the tornado. For real? Do we like that? Uh, fairies in black, Lolly. Um, Lolly, yes, Lisa. So the fairies are black in the black. The fairies are in the black. black. Cheyenne and I, I think Cheyenne and I are the same wavelength. She goes, ooh, yellow. That's like fluorescent yellow. It, it is my fluorescent. It's actually called fluorescent yellow. You got a That's Cool from Rob. Okay, let's bring the camera in and tilt it. Actually, you want some help? Mm, yeah, I could use some help. I just, um, I feel like I should just get it a little closer in and tilt it down, don't you? Just turn the... Sure. I'll do it, and then you can kind of okay. turn it into style. Okay. 
I just don't want the phones to like fall on the painting, like fall out of the deal. Okay, a little bit further. I think that's good right there. Okay. Yeah, it's streaming on Facebook too. It's streaming on Facebook and YouTube. Uh, but I wanted to go live on the journal on, um, on the Instagram page as well. So obviously it's just a wild abstract with a background. You guys, we just started this tonight, getting the first coat on. You guys always love to tell me what you see in the painting. So if you want to throw that out, especially if you're watching the replay, because I know you're not here tonight um, and you'll catch the replay. Um, we used some DIY paint colors in Water Lily an old 57. This is our fire starter in watered down. Then I used golden ticket right here on this side. And we have black, the fluorescent yellow, and then the deep magenta violet. And that gorgeous cobalt blue is um, an acrylic. Um, I had a question. Oh, uh, Joanne, is this how uh, is this how so now I'm going to tilt it back up so I can read is this how you do all of your abstracts no I don't do all of them this way actually um the large ones that I start I often do start them on the floor like this but my smaller ones I'll start on the Rob great call Rob says the yellow looks like a little girl's side profile oh I see that oh I see it that's a good call Rob yeah I do see that yeah. Okay. So I am going to set this back a little oh, bit. I'm sorry. I thought we were going to leave it like that for a little bit. Well, um, I can't read the comments and answer anything. Hi, guys. Hi, Patty. Yay. I see you guys. I'm waving at people. Boom, bada bing, bada bang. Um, Good night, Alice. On the journal lives, try new things like this. I will, Miss of Restored Grace. I appreciate you. Uh, thanks, thanks for being here tonight, you guys. Tomorrow's Wednesday. We'll be back at eight thirty Central Time. Um, we should be right on time tomorrow. So if you have any questions, you're watching the replay. Throw it out there. In gold, a female wearing pants and hair streaming out to the sides. Uh, Lolly, take care of you and uh, not Lolly. Uh, Alice, take care of you and your family, sister. I know you will. You'll be taking care of them so well. Um, it's a little bit wild right now, but I promise, come back. Um, this one we did a few nights ago, and then this is my newest series over here. Some of the pieces, a couple of them are gone, but everybody, thanks. This was fun. Matt, thanks for your help, bud. Oh, yeah. I love you. All right, everybody, have a great day tomorrow, and we'll see you back tomorrow. Where to find the journal? Hey, Jane, you go to the Turquoise Cyrus Journal on Facebook. It's It's a... Uh, and then if you want to go subscribe and get the first edition, you can go to the turquoiseirisjournal.com and click subscribe. And the next issue is coming out in January. And Quita Allen of All Shabbed Out will be our featured artist. And then we'll be featuring up to 15 other artists and creatives in that uh, journal issue too. So I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, but anyway, everybody take care. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. See ya. Good night.